Hello and welcome everyone. In this video, we will talk about joint types for beginners. Now the first question is why? Why are we learning joint types? Let me give you a context. Suppose you have a table with names of people and what subjects have they taken while studying in college. Next, there's a list of companies who have shortlisted candidates for an interview. When you wish to combine these tables, you would want to know what kind of output would be generated based on the ID. To understand the different variations is the reason why we learn join types. For Excel users, it's as simple as VLOOKUP. But as you graduate to newer applications such as Power BI, Tableau, Alteryx, Nine, etc., you would need to know the other variations. Now, this video is about beginner level understanding and therefore I will try to take non-technical way of explaining you things. So let's play a game to understand the joint types. Imagine there's one list which consists of people who you invited for a party. Then there's another list who actually attended the party. Now why am I putting them in two different circles? Shouldn't the list be the same? No. If I ask you, give me the list of people who were invited, attended, invited and attended, invited but did not attend, too busy in their work, and lastly, not invited but attended. These are the gate crashers. So let us see how to classify these five lists using join. So first question, if I want to find out the list of those people who were invited, it does not matter whether they attended or not. In that case, we'll talk about left outer join. Next, if I wish to talk about those people who actually attended the program, then I'll be talking about right outer join. So I hope in simple graphical terms, it's clear what is the difference between left outer and the right outer join. If yes, let me move on to talk about that group of people who were invited and attended the program. This is what we refer as inner join. Now, if I wish to talk about those people who were invited but did not attend, they were too busy in the work, they could not find time for your party and somehow could not make it. This is what we refer as left anti-join. Next the most interesting set of people that is those who did not get an invitation and yet gate crashed the party in our case this is what we refer as right anti-join so in real life based on the different data sets that you work with you may have to prepare list of row items based on specific criteria so while merging the query or bringing two different data sets together you may have to choose the right type of join to get your answer in fact, there's one more join which is relevant. So let me first explain the problem. I would want a list of people who were invited but did not attend, not invited but attended and those who were invited and attended. All these combined can be done through full outer join. So friends, in our next video, we'll talk about real data sets to be able to understand this concept fully. Just sharing a conclusion slide so that you can recollect all the joint types that we spoke about. See you in the next video.